Insightful podcasts by informative hosts. Insights into Things, a podcast network. Welcome to Insights into Teens, a podcast series exploring the issues and challenges of today's youth. Your hosts are Joseph and Madison Whalen, a father and daughter team making their way through the challenges of the teenage years. Welcome to Insights into Teens. This is episode 87, Would You Rather? I'm your host, Joseph Whalen, and my happy and well-adjusted co-host, Madison Whalen. Hi, everyone. How you doing, Maddie? Yeah, we're over there. Yeah. So uh, this is our Halloween episode. Uh, I guess it's really not Halloween themes, is it? Well, not really, but it is Halloween when we're recording this, so it, yay. We are recording on Halloween, so we're kind of in costume. I am your snuggied up host, uh, Darth Vader, and you are... Demon Pusheen. Demon Pusheen. <laughs> I had to get creative. I had a demon costume and a Pusheen onesie, and I'm like, hmm. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. Uh, we did take a little time to decorate the set a little bit here. Uh, you and mommy were our set designers today, so kudos to you guys. Thank you. So uh, sticking with the fun and um, exciting Halloween theme, uh, I thought we would do something a little bit different. We kind of had this planned in the works for a while now. Um, there's a game that we play uh, on our Amazon devices called Would You Rather? Well, it's a would you rather kind of game, but it's called either or. Either or. Right. I was close. So it's a game where it gives you two choices and you pick one or the other. And it's kind of a, I don't know, personality sort of challenge game type thing. And, and then they give you statistics on where you fit in there. But I thought it would be kind of neat if we went through and sort of in the spirit of our Q and a session, do a, would you rather session and see, uh, where you, where you land on some of these things. Alrighty. So we will be doing a couple of different topics. We will be doing technology. We will be doing pop culture, family, school, food, and then finally fantasy. Ooh. So anything else you want to talk about before we get into it? Well, I did turn 14 last week. You did? <laughs> Where was I? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, last week, last Friday, um, I had officially turned 14. Congratulations, sweetheart. Thank you. And to think when we started this podcast, you weren't even a teenager. Yeah. Is that is that unbelievable? <laughs> I was only twelve. That's that's pretty impressive. And then last weekend we uh, actually went to the Pennsylvania Renaissance Fair. We were in costume for that too. Yep. That was where you did your full demon costume. Mm-hmm. And mommy and daddy dressed in uh, Renaissancey stuff. Yeah. Ye old Renaissance. Ye old and Renaissance. <laughs> so we had some fun there. It was a good chance to get out. Uh, it was exclusively an outdoor event so we could socially distance and wear our masks and be safe and, and actually get out of the house for a little bit. Uh, programming note for next week, we will not be pro uh, podcasting next week. Again? Again, we have another event that we're doing uh, next weekend, so we won't be available to podcast, but we'll be back the following week on our regularly scheduled schedule. <laughs> um, I think that was all we had to go over there. You ready to get into it? Yeah, let's go. All right, let's start. All right, so a grueling game of Would You Rather, starting with technology. Here we go. Would you rather carry a flip phone or only use a desktop computer? Hmm. Uh... 
flip phone being a non-smartphone, old-style flip phone. Yeah, I know those. Okay. Hmm. And all. I'd probably carry around a flip phone because I can't just use the desktop computer because there's a lot of other stuff I do that's not on the computer. Yes, there is. Okay, so flip phone. Would you rather never play video games again or never use your favorite mobile app again? Um, does it matter? Wait, just answer so the question. <laughs> We're not going to debate it. Uh, probably never use, never play video games again. That's a tough one. Okay. Would you rather spend a day without your phone or a day with no people at all? Boy, that's a give me. <laughs> well... <laughs> Being an introvert, I'd probably go with the one day without people. That's kind of what I figured. Would you rather only use email to communicate or only use voicemails, no video calls? Like no actual real calls either? Only voice calls. Oh. Uh. Um. I'd probably not want to just do voice calls because, like... So then you would you would communicate with email only? Probably, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't like talking to people either. <laughs> Good thing we got a podcast, huh? Uh, would you rather only read e-books or read only physical books? What's e-books? Oh, like on your Kindle that you oh. don't use. <laughs> Um, I don't really read, but I don't really read on technology, so I'll probably not, I'll probably read, um, physical books. physical books. Okay. Would you rather live without a microwave or without a toaster? Without a toaster, because we don't make toast. We don't toast anything, yeah. <laughs> and we use the microwave constantly, so. Yeah, that's kind of an easy one there. Yep. Would you rather have no air conditioning or no heating? No air conditioning. I mean, no no heating. Oh, okay. <laughs> I meant All no right. heating. Because I'd be kicking you out <laughs> if you said no air conditioning. I'm sorry. Um, because, you know, we can always buy the warmer clothes. Because, But in the summer, you, like, you need the air conditioning. Absolutely. Uh, okay. Would you, or you can stay now, by the way. So Thanks. I'm not going to kick you out now. Thanks. Would you rather only charge your phone once a week or not have a camera on your phone? Um, does it count for screenshots? No. Okay. Uh, then I'd rather not have a camera on my phone. No. Okay. Mommy already takes enough pictures for us, so. That's the, except for today when I was opening my anniversary presents, which, side note, is our wedding anniversary today. Halloween anniversary. That way, Daddy, I'll never forget it. <laughs> yeah, best wedding ever. Uh, where are we at? Okay, would you rather never use a GPS or be able to drive stick shift cars? What's a stick shift car mean? Only be able to drive stick shift. Meaning you have to manually shift the car. You can't just put it in drive and go. Oh, probably drive without GPS. Okay. Would you rather only use Netflix or only use Hulu? Uh, Netflix. I use Netflix more than I really use Hulu. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. Although Disney Plus is pretty prominent in the house right yeah, now. Yeah. I Especially with Mandalorian back on the air. Season 2 premiered last night. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Yep. Which is a great segue into the next section, pop culture questions. Ooh. Okay, ready? Here we go. Would you rather have to listen to only Justin Bieber or only Ariana Grande for the rest of your life? Oh. I guess Ariana Grande. Okay, okay. I don't listen to either of those, so... Uh, yeah, I, I really there. don't listen to either of them. I know of the artist and some of their songs. So. Yeah. Okay, good enough. 
Would you rather only be able to watch movies starring The Rock, Dwayne Johnson, or only be able to watch movies starring Leonardo DiCaprio? Mm. What movies is Leonardo DiCaprio in? He was in Titanic, uh, Wolf of Wall Street. All stuff you've never seen. Yeah, probably the one with uh, The Rock Dwayne Johnson. Yeah, because you know, you know what movie he was in? I know. You're going to say it. Moana. <laughs> I'm never going to live that down. Nope. All right, here we go. Would you rather win an Oscar but not get to attend the ceremony or present an Oscar but not win anything? Uh... Win an Oscar but not be there because that's kind of what goes on now, so. Yeah, I'd, I'd rather that, too. Would you rather host Saturday Night Live or be The Bachelor or Bachelorette? Host Saturday Night Live. Okay. Not into the whole dating thing, huh? Gotcha. Uh, moving on to our feel-good television. Would you rather meet Oprah or Dr. Phil? Oprah. Me too. Dr. Phil kind of scares me. <laughs> Would you rather be a famous rapper or a famous singer? Probably a famous singer. I don't, I mean, I can talk fast, but I can't sing fast. That's good, because if you were a famous rapper, I probably wouldn't listen to you anyway. I don't listen to rap. <laughs> uh, Would you rather be a famous songwriter or a famous drummer? Oof. Um, I don't know how to write songs, but I do play the drums on rock bands. So. I don't know how to write songs, but I do know how to bang on things. So. <laughs> yeah, so drummer. Okay. Uh, would you rather win American Idol or American Ninja Warrior? What? That exists? Yeah. American Ninja Warrior, I guess. Just because you want to be a Ninja Warrior? Yes. Nice. And it sounds cool. Okay. Uh, would you rather tour with a famous band or tour with a famous comedian? Um, tour with a famous comedian because you never get bored. Well, that's true. You get bored with bands? How many bands have you toured with that you got bored with? <laughs> no, I, I, I haven't toured with any, I haven't toured with any one. <laughs> uh, okay. Last question in this category. Would you rather perform at the Super Bowl halftime show or play football at the Super Bowl? Uh, perform a halftime show. I yeah, don't... I figured you would. You're not a <laughs> yeah. big football fan. No, and playing it, I know I'm going to get hurt. <laughs> well, that's looking on the bright side. Well, that's all we have for those two uh, categories. We're going to take a quick break, and we'll come back, and we'll play some more Would You Rather family questions. For seven years, the Second Sith Empire has been the premier community guild in the online game Star Wars The Old Republic. With hundreds of friendly and helpful active members, a weekly schedule of nightly events, annual guild meet and greets, and an active community both on the web and on Discord. The Second Sith Empire is more than your typical gaming group. We're family. Join us on the Star Forge server for nightly events such as operations, flashpoints, world boss hunts, Star Wars trivia, guild lottery, and much more. Visit us on the web today at www.thesecondsithempire.com. All right, we are back. We're having a little fun with our Halloween edition today. We're playing Would You Rather. So, Madison, tell me, in our family segment here, would you rather have to switch closets with your dad or only wear the clothes your grandma buys for you? Uh, probably wear the clothes my grandma buys because, one, the clothes for you, for me, for the 
the clothes that you have are probably a little too big for me. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> um, and I know Jima would probably get something that um, I would like. Yes, so. she will. Or she'd make something you'd like. Yeah, she'd make something. Uh, would you rather be an only child or have ten siblings? Be an only child. Yeah, me too. I can imagine the chaos we have with having ten siblings. Well, I had three siblings, and it didn't work out so well for me. So, would you rather have a famous family member or be the famous family member? Have a famous family member. I don't really want to be like the center of attention. I can't really handle the spotlight. Okay, fair enough. Would you rather have your own family reality TV show? Or have your own family band? Family reality TV show, because I'm pretty sure we could probably be on reality TV. I, you know, I, I almost think that, that what we do on these podcasts these days is kind of our version of a family reality show. Kind of like it. So much of our family stuff comes out in it. Mm-hmm. Next up, would you rather be the oldest child or the youngest child? Oh, um... I'd probably want to be the youngest. I normally like being the youngest and having older people near me. And I and when like I can relate it to school. Like when I was in like second grade of my school, um, I it felt kind of nice um, that there were people older than me, and I kind of felt like I was fine being a little uh, a little fish in a big pond. But then once you become the big fish in a little pond, it's like, um. Really? Am I supposed to be here? I f still feel like I'm supposed to be younger than this. Yeah. Yeah, it can be overwhelming. Would you rather have your grandma or your grandpa follow you around school for the day? Mm. So is it Gma or is it Pepe following you around school? Ooh, I don't know. Um, hmm. They're both great. I don't know who I'd want to, like, follow me around school because I could both picture different scenarios, but um, I think Pepe would kind of make it have more funny scenarios going on. And I agree. I think Gma would probably be the most helpful person to have with you, but I think Pepe would probably be the most entertaining person <laughs> with just some of the things that he does. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, where are we here? Would you rather... Own a restaurant with your family or own a retail clothing store with your family? Own a restaurant. I like food. Okay. Uh, I, could, I could certainly understand that. Would you rather have to do laundry for your family or cook meals for your family? We well, could do one of those already. So Yeah. And I used to cook meals for you guys. Right. Um. You're like Cinderella. You do all the work. Yeah, pretty much. Um, I don't know. They're not, like, I don't prefer one over the other because they seem fairly simple. I enjoy cooking and laundry doesn't take too long to do. So that one's kind of a push. Okay. Would you rather eat a meal out by yourself or eat home with your family? Eat home with my family. There's a lot of stuff that goes on at dinners that I don't really want to miss out on. Yeah, that's true. The last one for our family questions. Would you rather take care of all your family's pets or have no pets at all? Take care of all the family's pets. Yeah, that was kind of an easy one. Yeah, I'm not getting rid of any of the pets. All right, so the next category we have here is the always fun and entertaining school. So, first up is, would you rather teach a class in high school or have your parents teach one of your classes? Have my parents teach one of my classes. I can tell you it would be one of those, like, goofy teachers um, that tries to make the class fun. Who, who would, me or mommy? You would. Mommy, she'd be a little more strict but still want to have fun. You'd, so you'd probably learn more with mommy. <laughs> yes. And it, again, it's that. <laughs> well, know, then again, you have like a really, like, you guys would be good at different subjects. Mommy's probably better with math and ELA, while you're great with science and history. That's true. That's true. But I think it's another one of those G Mon, Mommy would be the more helpful, and Pepe and Daddy would be the more entertaining, probably. 
It's okay. I can live with that moniker. Uh, would you rather go to school four days a week for 10 hours or five days a week for eight hours? Mm, or like so now, not go to school for three hours. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hang on. So, go to school four days for 10 hours. That would be 40. That's the exact same amount of hours. Right, but you can do it in four days or you can do it in five days. Four days. Yeah, that's kind of how I'd prefer my work schedule, too. Would you rather sing in front of the whole school or be in a spelling bee in front of the entire school? Probably sing in front of the whole school because I am not very good with spelling. Yeah, I'd be the same way. You know, I'd rather look like I have no talent rather than, you know, inability to spell in front of the whole school. Yeah, I have a problem with saying words out loud and I have a problem and I I have more of a problem saying words out loud than I do writing them down. But even writing them down, I spell things wrong. Well, I think you do pretty good. Thanks. Uh, Would you rather clean the bathrooms at your school or clean up after lunch in the cafeteria at your school? Um, probably clean up the cafeteria, although, you know, it's probably even more messy than the toilets are. Yeah, true. Okay, would you rather ride the bus to school or walk to school? Um, before, ride the bus. Um, now, maybe ride the bus. Now? You're going to ride a bus from your from your bedroom down to the kitchen to do your schoolwork? No. Wow, that's lazy. Okay. Uh, Not now. All right. Uh, Would you rather have access to the teacher's lounge or be able to drive a school bus? Access to the teacher's lounge. I've seen what kids do on the bus, and I can imagine driving the bus would be very annoying having to hear all the constant voices. Yeah, that's true. Would you rather say the morning announcements or be the school sports commentator? School sports commentator. (laughs) Even though I don't like sports, I'd want to be a commentator. I could, I feel like I would be a good commentator. You'd be a good monologuer. Yeah, I can, I monologue when I play video games. I'm pretty sure I can monologue when the game goes on. Yep. This one might need a little explaining, so. If you don't understand what the what the other option is, just say so. Would you rather be the prom king or queen or the valedictorian? The what? The valedictorian is the highest person with the highest grade point average in the school. Probably the valedictorian. That's what I figure. Uh, would you rather handwrite all of your homework or use the computer to do it, but... You always get one letter grade lower than you usually would using the computer. Handwrite all my work. Yeah, I figured you would, being the perfectionist that you are. And the last question in our exciting school segment, would you rather get the highest score on the SAT or your school at your school? Sorry, would you rather get the highest score on your SAT at your school or be the best athlete in your school? Highest SAT in my school. You are like an overachieving scholastic machine, aren't you? Yeah, and I prefer not to be in any athletics most of the time. Okay, nothing wrong with that. So we're going to take a quick break. We will come back and we will start on food. Insights into Entertainment, a podcast series taking a deeper look into entertainment and media. Our husband and wife team of pop culture fanatics are exploring all things from music and movies to television and fandom. We'll look at the interesting and obscure entertainment news of the week. We'll talk about theme park and pop culture news. We'll give you the latest and greatest on pop culture conventions. We'll give you a deep dive into Disney, Star Wars, and much more. Check out our video episodes at youtube.com backslash insights into things. Our audio episodes at podcast.insightsintoentertainment.com 
or check us out on the web at insightsintothings.com. Welcome back to our Halloween special. We are playing Would You Rather. Uh, I kind of feel like I should have some theme music or something going into these segments and make <laughs> it really feel like a game show. But Yeah, dude. Like, do we have one of the sound things? Uh, like, no, I didn't get the board set up. Darn it. Yeah, well, that's what happens when you switch topics right before the show goes live. <laughs> so our next segment is on food, and then we'll finish up with fantasy. Nice. Would you rather eat spicy wings or bite into ice cream? Oh. <laughs> I know, that gets me chills just thinking about it. Uh, spicy wings. Yeah. At yeah. least then, like, I can... Uh. Uh, you lost your horns there, your devil horns. You're, oh, well. You're only a partial demon now. <laughs> um, I would probably eat the spicy wings because then you can, like, um, chuck milk. Okay, that works. Would you rather... Work at Chick-fil-A or work at the fanciest restaurant in town? Mm, Chick-fil-A. Okay. No pressure, but I, I don't think the tips are as good. Yeah, but, you know, you got to start somewhere. That's true. Would you rather be a famous baker or a famous barbecue master? A uh, baker. I don't really barbecue because we don't actually have a grill to barbecue stuff in. We don't really bake either. <laughs> Maybe once a year. Um, Cheesecake. Once a year, which looks like we're not going to be doing cookies. it this year, unfortunately. But there is cookies that we do sometimes. That's true. All right. Would you rather eat your favorite meal every day or never eat it again? Mmm... Depends which meal I'm going to be considering. Um, I mean, I eat burgers a lot. You eat burgers constantly, I know. Uh, so I'll probably eat my favorite food, like, pretty much every day. Okay. I can and see that. And I can kind of cheat saying, like, oh, I just take a bit, like, for a snack, and then I eat whatever else that I was going to eat originally. Well, so I that's just take cheating. You don't cheat. There's no cheating in Would You Rather. Really? Really. Fine. Um, uh, always trying to get around the rules. Would you rather have to eat one dog treat per day plus whatever food you want or never eat dog food, but you could only eat cereal? That's a real stretch on that one. Do you like dog treats? I've never had one because I don't have a dog. Yeah. Do you like cat treats? I've never had them because I've never eaten them. Have you smelled them? Yeah. Yeah, I probably wouldn't want to eat them. I'll actually, like, eat, a, like, I can wash it down. Okay, so you're going to eat a dog treat every day plus whatever else you want. Yeah. Okay. Would you rather eat steak for a week or ice cream for a week? Mm, ice cream for a week because I really don't eat steak unless it's a burger. Yeah, but ice cream for a week, you're getting back to that liquid diet, though. That's not part of it. Ice cream's the only good part that came out of okay. it. <laughs> Would you rather do all the grocery shopping for your family or do all the cooking for your family? Mm, probably the cooking. I'll leave the shopping to Mommy. Yeah, grocery shopping's not that fun. Mommy's a trooper for doing that. Yeah. Would you rather never eat condiments again or put them on everything you eat? Now, let's, we have to take a quick aside here. So, your selection of condiments consists of what? Mayo chop. Which is? Ketchup and mayo put together to make mayo chop, or as we like to call it, kudzma. What do we call it? Mayo chop. We call it mayo chop. Not just mayo chop. We made up a name for it. Yeah. Cat, cat. Well, until we discovered that, that Heinz actually makes it. Yeah. Because the original premise was you were going to invent this new condiment that's a combination of these two, and then we're going to market and get rich and live off the royalties from it. And then Mommy went to the supermarket and found Mayo Chop. Yeah, that was one of the most disappointing moments, but yeah. also kind of 
kind of convenient. So ones. would you never, would you want to never eat mayo chup again or eat it on everything? Well, at this point, seeing that my, seeing what my dinners have been consisted of, yeah, I'll probably eat it like with everything because for some reason, every time I look at my dinner plate, most of the time I just see a pile of mayo chup. Okay. This next question is a real conflict, especially for you knowing what your eating habits are. Would you rather be allergic to chocolate or allergic to bread? (laughs) Which one would you rather lose? Mm. Be allergic to bread. To bread. Okay. That means no more bread for you. So the last question in our grueling food segment. Would you rather have all your food be spicy or have all your food be sweet? All the food be spicy. Spicy, really? I would not have expected that. Yeah, I like probably when I get to the sweet taste, it'll probably just I'll probably just get used to it. And with spicy, at least like I'll get a different spice, and my mouth goes up in flames every time I'll eat it. Okay, oh, I I guess that's good. So the last uh, group of questions we have are fantasy based questions. These kind of encompass a lot of different things. So let's get right into it. Would you rather break everything you touch or get shocked every time you touch something? Uh, I think I kind of already have, like, the break everything I touch thing because, like, (laughs) I've been known to break a lot of things I touch. Well, you know, winter is coming, so everything you touch you're going to get shocked on in the winter. So True. So which one would it be? You want to break everything or get shocked every time? I'll probably get shocked every time. Okay. I could understand that. Would you rather be your family dog or a wild wolf? Um, hmm. I mean, both have pluses. Being a Being a family dog means you get to laze around all day and the hard work's already done for you. But being a wolf, you get to run around freely, but you still have to survive, but but you're a big predator. So I guess I'll go with the wolf. Okay, freedom it is. Would you rather be the best athlete who ever lived or the best singer who ever lived? Singer. Probably the best singer because... I don't think I'll really get the best athletic ever. Okay. I'm not going to argue with that. I wouldn't either. Would you rather live 100 years in the future or 100 years in the past? Well, with the way things are going now, probably 100 years in the past. Yeah, I get that. That way you can kind of stop what's going on in a way and maybe fix it for the better future. I could see that. Would you rather have super strength or super hearing? Strength or super hearing? Uh, super strength. Um, I don't hear pretty well myself. Um, actually, you know what? Maybe super hearing would actually be kind of good. This way, when mommy and daddy call you and you have your headphones on listening to music, you'll actually hear us? Yeah, I'll have super hearing. Wouldn't that be nice? Uh, Would you rather make the best movie ever or the best album ever? Mm, Best movie ever. Yeah. I like directing. Yeah, I kind of figured you would. Would you rather be an Instagram influencer or only be YouTube famous? Only be YouTube famous. I don't really use social media and YouTube. I watch videos on it constantly. Okay, makes sense. Would you rather have a pet dragon or a pet unicorn? Pet dragon, definitely. 
dragons are superior. <laughs> That's the demon we all know and love. Yeah. N unicorns are just magical horses with horns. Demon uh, dragons um, are cool. They breathe fire. And in fact, I'm thinking of a dragon story. Yeah, I can't imagine. <laughs> um, side note, we did win a little tiny dragon when we were at the Ren Fair. Uh, we had sat down for, I don't know, 10 minutes. Mommy went to get something for us to eat. And in the 10 minutes it took for her to come back with what she was getting for us, you had an entire backstory set up for the dragon in that short amount of time. So I think that was that was really cool. Yep. Uh, okay, next. Would you rather be the richest person in the world and hate what you do? Or have an average wage and love what you do. Have an average wage and love what I do. I don't need a ton of money. Money doesn't buy happiness. Yeah. But it doesn't hurt. Uh, would you rather, and this is the last question we have actually for today, so we're actually running a little, little ahead of schedule. Would you rather read minds or have read every book in the world? Probably read minds. I don't really read books a lot, so I'll probably read minds a bit. It would be a little more useful. Okay. Could be dangerous knowing what people think all the time, though. True, though, but I could tell who is crazy and who's not. Okay. Well, I, I guess that works. Uh, we're going to take a quick break, come back, and we'll get your closing uh, thoughts and finish up with some podcast business. Alrighty, so do you have closing thoughts? Uh, I don't know. I'm just, uh, I guess I'll just wish everyone a happy Halloween. Um, make sure to do it safely, stay safe, and enjoy. That's it? Uh, I guess. I mean, it, <laughs> I don't really know what else to say. Well, the topics if, have been. If I was you, I would, you know, wish my parents a happy anniversary or something like that. I'll wish you guys a happy anniversary as well. <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh, yeah, that was all we had for this week. We just wanted to have a little bit of fun. We actually do have another uh, Would You Rather segment uh, podcast scheduled for a couple of weeks. Um, we had a lot of questions. I didn't, I didn't want to throw them all in this one here. Uh, so we'll be back next, not next week, but the following week. Before we do go, I would uh, invite folks to subscribe to the podcast. We're available on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Google, Stitcher, iHeartRadio, and Amazon now. You can get us on any of your podcast catchers. I would also invite folks to reach out to us and give us your feedback. You can email us at comments at insightsintothings.com. We're on Twitter at Insights Into Things. We are on Facebook at facebook.com slash insights into things podcast on Instagram at insights into things. And you can get links to all of our social media and videos and audio at our website, www.insightsintothings.com and you. And don't forget to check out our other two podcasts, Insights in the Entertainment, hosted by you and Mommy, and Insights in the Tomorrow, our monthly podcast, hosted by you and my brother, Sam. And that's it. Another one in the books. Bye, everyone. Bye.